Across the region, we're seeing an enormous outpouring of support for our health service. Impressive sites like this 100 metre wide land art in Calderdale and Rax Power Station lit up in blue to give a boost to the NHS. The residents of this street in Leeds say their Thursday night clap for carers is a highlight of the week. They direct their applause to one house in particular, this one where doctors live. But they, along with other doctors, would like to thank the many unsung heroes in the hospital. I'm a consultant rheumatologist at Bradford Teaching Hospitals. And I'm a GP in Leeds. I would like to say a huge thank you to Jennifer and the rheumatology secretaries. I'll be clapping for our IT team tonight. I'm a medical registrar in South Yorkshire. And I'm a junior doctor in the NHS. I'm a consultant in acute medicine at Pinderfield in Wakefield. I'm an A&E consultant at Bradford Royal Infirmary. This week, when you're clapping for the NHS, I'd like you to bear in mind the radiographers are working really hard at the moment. Tonight, I'd like to say a special thank you to pharmacists and pharmacy technicians. So this Thursday, when you applaud the NHS carers, please think of the Infection Prevention and Control Team. And I'd like to nominate the porters. To remember the healthcare support workers, as they work really hard to give the kind of care that you would want for your loved one. The staff delivering back-to-back -back training to ensure that the NHS delivers at its absolute best. I'm so proud to see how we've responded in these unprecedented times. Our teams have learnt new roles and adapted quickly, not thinking about what they can't do, but instead thinking about what they can do. We are also proud of our frontline staff here at Doncaster and Bassett Boss Law Teaching Hospitals. I want to give a massive clap to everyone at Wolfring Clinic. The next time you clap for the NHS, please keep in mind all our admin staff who work in the background. Hi, my name's Kayleigh. I'm one of the and A&E at Bradford Royal Infirmary. There are so many thank yous for us all to say, but I really wanted to say thank you to the reception staff. Without them, we couldn't do half the things that we do, and thank you so, so much. So my name's Victoria, I'm one of the A&E consultants at Bradford Royal Infirmary. And I just want to say thank you to the cleaners, for all the hard work they do, clean up after me and all my nice So thank you. To the public, we want to say a massive thank you. From Bradford, A and &E. Thank you, everyone. Without these people, the hospitals can't fight this virus. So tonight, once more, we'll be shining a spotlight on everyone in our NHS. Hannah Gray, BBC Look North.